When it comes to fat burger, fast food doesn't mean sacrificing quality. This burger chain is all about taking the time to make every burger a masterpiece. So if you're looking for a drive through joint that'll sling a mediocre burger at you in seconds flat, then you're in the wrong place. At Fat Burger, they don't believe in pre-made patties or reheated buns. Oh no. Every burger is made fresh to order with only the finest ingredients. That's right. The grill is hot, the meat is juicy, and the toppings are ready to rock and roll. But let's be real here. Some folks just can't handle the weight. If you're the type of person who wants your food ASAP, then you might want to keep moving. Because at Fat Burger, they take their time to ensure that every burger is cooked to perfection. And trust us, it's worth the wait. Well, join us on this lip smacking journey as we unravel the story of Fat Burger's humble beginnings and how it became a worldwide sensation. It all started when a fierce lady named Lovey Yancey decided she wanted to make the world's best burgers. She called it Mr. Fat Burger after her man. And boy, did those burgers live up to their name. But in 1952, Lovey kicked her partner to the curb and decided she didn't need no man's name on her burgers. So she dropped the Mr. and Fat Burger was born. Now this burger joint was so good, it stayed mostly in California until the late 90s. But once people started to catch on, they couldn't stop the Fat Burger train. And guess what? They're not stopping anytime soon. With over 150 restaurants around the world and plans for 300 more, it's safe to say that Fat Burger is here to stay. But like any good story, there were some hiccups along the way. At one point, the company was barred from selling more franchises due to their chairperson's felony convictions. Fat Burger didn't just conquer America, it took over the world. You know you've made it big when you get name-dropped in hit songs by Ice Cube and the Notorious B.I.G., but that's not all. Fat Burger went on to open its first ever stadium location in 2008 at Chase Field, home of the Arizona Diamondbacks. Because what's better than cheering on your favorite sports team with a juicy burger in your hand, am I right? And let's talk about international expansion. Fat Burger has eight locations in Dubai, proving that the love for burgers is universal. They even made their way to Beijing, China. But the biggest success story? The opening of their first ever branch in Karachi, Pakistan in 2013. The burgers were such a hit that they opened their flagship outlet in Lahore just a few months later. But with great success comes great responsibility. And in 2015, one of their branches in Lahore was shut down due to health and food safety concerns. Hey, no one said making the world's best burgers was easy. But you know what they say, when one door closes, another opens. And in Fat Burger's case, that door leads to even more delicious burgers. Now, what about these burgers? The name says it all, folks. Fat Burger doesn't mess around when it comes to size and flavor. Founder Lovey Yancey knew what she was doing when she came up with the name, wanting to convey the idea of a big burger with everything in it, a meal in itself. And let's talk about those toppings. Fat Burger doesn't skimp on the good stuff. You've got a sourdough bun, mayo, lettuce, tomato, pickles, onions, relish, and mustard, all on top of a juicy patty. And if you're feeling a little cheesy, they've got you covered with the option to add cheese between the burger and the bottom bun. But here's where Fat Burger takes it up a notch. They offer a perfectly fried egg as an optional topping. Yes, you heard that right. A fried egg on top of your burger. Don't knock it till you tried it because Fat Burger loyalists swear by this addition. Ready for some more fun facts about Fat Burger? Well, here we go. And if you like to learn about the history of your favorite eateries, be sure to subscribe for more content like this. It's not just regular folks who love Fat Burger, but some of the biggest names in showbiz too. We're talking about Justin Bieber, Nicki Minaj, David Letterman, and Jay Leno, just to name a few. And it's not just celebrities who love the burgers. Fat Burger has been name-dropped in countless songs by some of the biggest rappers of all time. Ice Cube, Tupac, and the Notorious B.I.G. have all given the burger joint a shout-out in their tracks. But Fat Burger's popularity doesn't stop there. Even Magic Johnson invested in the chain, leading a group of investors to buy it in 2001. And celebrities like Pharrell Williams, Kanye West, and Queen Latifah have owned their own Fat Burger franchises. But don't worry. Even if you're not famous, you can still get your hands on one of those famous burgers.
It's interesting to see how the first fat burger location in Los Angeles has become an historic landmark and how the city has found a way to preserve its cultural significance while still addressing the needs for affordable housing. Lovey Yancey's entrepreneurial spirit and the success of Fat Burger are truly remarkable, and it's great to see her legacy being honored in this way. The fact that the building can't be destroyed shows just how important Fat Burger has become to the community. It's amazing to think that a humble burger joint could have such an impact on a neighborhood and inspire so much creativity and innovation in the years that followed. Moving on, picture this. A fat burger patty hitting the griddle in the form of a meatball, getting flattened with a grill press to create those juicy, craggy edges. Why not just start with a preformed patty, you ask? Because it's not just a burger, it's a work of art. Those rough edges char to crispy perfection and give fat burgers their unique texture. Speaking of unique, have you heard of the XXXL King Burger? It's so big, it's like a mini mountain on a bun. With three patties and a whopping one and a half pounds of beef, this burger is not for the faint of heart. You might want to bring a friend and split it, unless you're ready to take on 1,668 to 2,050 calories all by yourself. Just watching someone attempt to conquer this behemoth on YouTube is enough to make your stomach rumble. In 2011, Fox Broadcasting partnered with Fat Burger to promote its animated sitcom, Bob's Burgers, by giving away free burgers via variety. That's right, free burgers. Who doesn't love free food? Especially when it's from a fictional fast food joint brought to life. Fat Burger locations across the country participated, but select restaurants in Los Angeles, Las Vegas, Chicago, and New Jersey went all out by being rebranded as Bob's Burgers for an entire month. Imagine walking into your local fat burger joint and being greeted by cardboard cutouts of the Bob's Burgers characters. And the packaging? You guessed it. It was branded with the Bob's Burgers logo. Fox had done something similar before, turning several 7-Eleven convenience stores into quickie marts to promote their hit show The Simpsons. Fox knows how to make their fans happy and well-fed. Do you remember the show Undercover Boss? Well, in 2013, Fat Burger CEO Andy Whiterhorn went incognito at one of the chain's Arizona locations for an episode. Wearing a wig, fake mustache, and even some gold jewelry, Whiterhorn spent the day grilling burgers, working the cash register, and scrubbing dishes. He wanted to see the operation from a team member's perspective and not just as the CEO in a suit. At the time, Fat Burger's Arizona stores were struggling, which is why Whiterhorn went undercover at the Mesa restaurant. The big reveal that their new employee was actually their highest-ranking boss was shocking to the store manager. But it was also cool to know that someone in corporate saw their hard work. After the show, Whiterhorn implemented programs to improve communication between restaurant employees and top management. Once upon a time in California, a group of high school students would gather weekly at 4.20 p.m. to search for a mythical pot plant rumored to be growing near their school. Little did they know that this weekly ritual would plant the seed for what would become an unofficial holiday for weed enthusiasts. And now, Fat Burger was joining in on the 420 hype with some deals that Cheech and Chong themselves would surely appreciate. On April 20th, 2022, customers could score an OG Fat Burger for just $4.20, and all online orders of $20 or more received free delivery for the entire month. Plus, for those who were in Los Angeles, and like to indulge in marijuana, Fat Burger's Strawberry Milkshake was available in THC form at Wonder Bread on 420 only. And that's a wrap on the juicy details of Fat Burger. Did you learn something new today? Are you now craving a big juicy burger with those craggy edges? Well, we have a question for you. When it comes to burgers, are you team pro-formed patty or team hand-pressed craggy edges? Let us know in the comments. And don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to support our channel. And if you're feeling extra hungry, why not head to your nearest fat burger and give their XXXL King Burger a try? Just make sure to share it with a friend or two.